Well, howdy friends and welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna do something a little bit different. This is an Erin Condren haul. However, these things were actually sent to me by the team at Erin Condren. One of these things is something I wouldn't normally buy for myself and I'll explain why as soon as I open it. And then some of the other things I was really excited to see and I'm, I'm excited to see everything to be completely honest. Um, these are things that I've never seen before and some of their new releases. This is a teacher themed haul. So these are just kind of my basic first impressions. I know that the paper quality is the same, so I'm not gonna be doing a pen test today, but let's open it and see what I got. I like, all I've done is just, here, I'll show you. <laughs> I just like lifted this and peek inside to make sure it's the right order. And then I was like, okay, I'm covering up the address and I am filming this bad boy. So let's open this up. I know it's gonna look kind of crooked for a minute, but, um, you get the uh, create your own sunshine and it's like a little postcard, which is great. And this feels different. Like it feels very like silky compared to the other ones, which is kind of cool. And then an enjoy sticker. I do keep all of these. And then if we open it up, I can never open it up like really nicely. Dun, 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 dun. All right, let me pull all this stuff out of here because I don't like the crinkly sound when I do the video. And let's just keep on going. So this is what I wanted to show you guys. This is, oh my gosh, I can't like. There's so many things on my desk here. Oh no, oh no, things are falling down. Oh no, things are falling. Uh-oh, okay, hold on. All right, are we good? No, we're not. We're still not good. Okay, here it goes. Yeah. So here it is. This is the teacher lesson planner. Yeah, look at this. It is so big, you guys. Let me show you for scale. So this is my regular like seven by nine Erin Condren planner. And let me just like put it right in the corner here. So that's the difference in size scale. Crazy, right? I think it, I like this big one. I think this is cool. Um, but anyway, this is my like regular planner, but I just wanted to like pull that out for size. You still get one of these clip-in rulers, which has the protective film on it. I got the colorful pencils um, design colorway. I did not get it personalized because if you guys know me, I'm not like really into that much personalization, but you know, I wanted to look at this. It also has like the dry erase, so you can do this just like a regular one. And then you open up the first page and it says, teacher lesson planner, this book belongs to. So let's just do like a little walkthrough of this because I've never seen this before and I wanna know what's in it too. Um, so anyway, this is just like a nice information page that has just like all of your contact information, your classroom resources, the web resources and passwords, classroom events and volunteers, date and event information. And I like how it has like all these little tabs too, just like the regular planner, but it has like different types of tabs. Communication log. You've got 2018, 2019. A lot of people like to use like little transparent dots and put like a key up at the top or the bottom, just like in your, um, you know, the regular seven by nine life planner. And um, then you've got your year plan. So you've got January through December. And then we go along to graph paper. So we've got a couple of sheets of that. Yeah, a few sheets of graph paper. Oh, and then there's some lined pages. And then this starts July. On the front page of the July monthly view is just a bunch of lines, which is nice. And then also dates to remember if you've got like things going on or conferences or special meetings or something like that. Nice to know. And then here is the month view. And I like how in the new planners for 2018, 2019, they have included in the bottom right hand corner the next month. So you can kind of like look ahead a little bit, which is really great. And then we've got all of our days. So you've got Monday through Friday, and then you've got six different categories here. So you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, and then you've got kind of a blank category, which you could make like a seventh category or it could be like a total of or a tally or something like that. So it's just Monday through Friday. And then also there's just these little, little lines. So it gives you a little bit of a guide, which is nice. So if you're actually writing or if you're using stickers or whatever you're trying to do. So that happens for all of the weeks it looks like. And then what happens at the end of the month? Okay, so at the end of the month you get two lined pages, which is fabulous. Oh. 
And then also when you flip to the next month, then you've got more line pages, the dates to remember, and then into August. So it goes like this until May of next year, or sorry, June of next year. I'm sorry, I didn't, I can't see y'all. So let's get to the end of June. All right, so we're at the end of June here, and then we've got, oh, this is really nice. We've got a page that says July right there, and that's actually really nice, so if you know something that's coming up in your next school year, like 2019, 2020, which, wow, that sounds, that sounds, way far ahead, but it's really not. Um, you can, you know, make some notes or things like that to put into your next teacher lesson planner. Um, this is just a little checklist. Um, and I believe the checklist was the one that you could get modified. Um, so you could get um, the standard amount of pages or you could get more pages for a fee. Um, but I like that there is a, you know, name category. Oh, and it says you can fold or cut along this line. Oh, okay, so you can go. I don't know, like you can do it like this maybe? I don't know how that would work. I'm not a teacher, guys, so I don't know. And you can put like assignments up here, um, and then you can just like keep going with, you know, what you got happening here, or a name, I don't know. I don't know how this works. Um, but yeah, I got some extra pages, because I just wanted to like see how it would look. And then I wanna see the back because I have heard that the stickers are really, really good, y'all. Okay, all right, and then so the back says, a good teacher is like a candle, it consumes itself to light the way for others. That's really cute. Um, all right, and then these stickers are so good. So you've got some calculators, stars, globes, check, books, hearts, it looks like kind of sciencey looking things, exclamation points, it says IEP, little asterisks, and then we got some apples, and then there's some different phrases, it says note to self, meeting, furlough, assembly, holiday, testing, reminder, field trip, conferences, and to do which is all in the different kinds of foil. Hopefully that's coming off on camera. It's kind of a gloomy day today, so it might not be coming off on camera very well. And then we have this sheet, which is so pretty. It's got like coffee and birthday cake and like just some functional and decorative. Oh, this is so pretty. And then these little apples down here say like big day, break, time to prep, me time, note to self, you did it, awesome, and way to go. Those are really cute. Oh my gosh, I'm like obsessed with these. These binder clips are giving me life, you guys. Those are so freaking cute. Oh my gosh. This whole page, like I just, I, I, I want this whole page. <laughs> this is so nice. Um, yeah, so there is more of these functional and decorative stickers, loving this, and the foil is so good, y'all. Oh, and then we've got our standard, our tried and true basic functional event stickers, which is awesome. And then over here on the back side, we've got a pocket folder, which is great. And then it's got, you know, this pocket back here too. Again, over here is going to be, oh, this is that, um, all right, this is another thing you could get more of, I believe. I think you could add additional ones in here. This is like a slip pocket. So you could, um, it's like a sheet protector. So you can put, you know, things in here. So you could put like this kind of stuff in here like this. Or you could put like sheets in there. I believe that you could order more of these to get coiled in to your planner as well. Kind of cool, right? And then the back is the same as the front, but reversed. <laughs> cool, right? And I know some of you are gonna be like, Emily, you're clearly not a teacher and you clearly don't have children. What are you gonna do with this planner? And my answer is, I'm not sure. But I thought that this would be a really cool thing to show you guys, um, just so you can see the inside of it. I mean, I've been an Erin Condren fan for like several years and I had never seen, like physically seen the inside of a teacher planner from Erin Condren ever. So it's kind of cool. Like, I think it's kind of neat. And if it, even if, Okay, so like, this is me trying to like modify everything in life. So even if you worked like a regular, like a Monday through Friday job and you never worked a weekend or anything like that, you could definitely use this, um, you know, probably minus the like, the checklists or whatever. Um, but you could definitely use this 
for like different categories of the day or I don't know. I mean, you could use it for so many different things. Um, and I think that's just kind of like what's cool about a lot of the products from Erin Condren is that you can kind of modify it to fit the needs of whatever you want it for. But I think it would be actually be really cool for like a work planner as well. Um, you know, like if you wanted to modify it, but you know, you could just use like a regular life planner as well. But if you really like these categories, which I kind of find really interesting, um, that would be really, really kind of cool. And even, okay, so this is like back in the day when I used to do like retail management and I didn't have like a ton of employees, but I'm just thinking about this right now on the fly sitting here. So say like November 5th through 9th, I mean, obviously I worked retail, but like I didn't have a ton of employees. I, at one of the locations I worked at doing retail, I think I had like six employees. So this would actually be perfect. So like you could put everybody's, like all the employees names on there. And then the shift that they, like if they work on Monday, then you put their shift down and then you put like tasks for them. So you could like literally just have this open like on the desk and then people could come in and see like, oh, Tim needs to do blah, 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 blah. And then like Heather needs to do do, 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 do on this date. Like that's kind of nice. And you can just like check it off when it's done. Like that would actually be really kind of a cool thing. But this is just me talking about ideas. So obviously you could do whatever you want to with it. But I think this is a really, really neat planner for sure. Or I wanted to show you guys this planner, but I also want to show you guys the rest of the haul that I got. So when I was talking to the team at Erin Condren, I really wanted this video to be focused on this planner as well as some of the accessories that I feel like could be used for lots of different things. And um, um, so let's get into some of the accessories. So with my order came these pens. Let me zoom in a little bit for the rest of this because yeah. Um, these pens are amazing. They are the fine tip designer gel pens in the classic. There's four of them at 0.5 millimeter fine point pens. I have not tried them yet, but let's try them now. I'm gonna just I just have some like white sticky note paper. Um, I know some people um, actually got these, but they were supposed to be just like a free gift with purchase as of right now. But I don't know if they're gonna put them on their website at all. Maybe they will, I don't know. So let's try them. All right, so there's the green. Kind of skipped a little bit at the very beginning, but of course it's never been used before. So that could be something to do with it. This one skipped a little bit at the beginning too, but saved itself in the end. These feel really nice, actually. Yeah, these, these do feel quite nice. Oh yeah, the black one's my favorite for sure. <laughs> but yeah, these feel really nice. Let me um, zoom you guys in so you can see that a little bit better. So at the very beginning, it was skipping a little bit, but that's because I've clearly never, <laughs> never used these before, so that's probably why. The, so the next thing I got was some flair. Um, they got the Erin Condren signature glasses with a mug of happiness and then also a pencil. I'm not gonna take these out because I don't think it really, you know, you don't need to like see them in action. They're just some flare pins, which I love. I also ended up getting these lined sticky notes. Um, these are the new ones for last, or new ones for last, new ones for this year um, that are the uh, teacher collection. And let me show you guys what it looks like inside of the lesson planner. So usually you grab a month and then you put it right here. Um, yeah, it like fits perfect. It's got this little 3M tab right here, so you could really put it on whatever you would like. Um, the sticky is the same as last year where it goes down about halfway, a little less than halfway. And then um, you can just sticker right on to here. Kinda nice, right? And then this is the old planner. I don't have a new planner for this year yet, and I don't know if and when I'll, I mean, I don't know when I'll be getting one, but um, this is the same size as the ones from last year, if you guys can see that, like it goes down all the way. But um, yeah, I think that's really nice. I, I like a good sticky note, you guys. I really do enjoy a good sticky note. Oh, and these are called the Stylized Sticky Note Pad. Also a free gift was, um, this was free with a teacher lesson planner when um, I placed the order. And then these are really cool too. They're just some gift labels and they've got a couple of different designs. Let's look at them. But this was also a free gift at the time that I placed the order. 
And so you've got, oh cool, there's a couple of different varieties in here. And you could use these for like name tags or you could use them for like gifts or I don't know, you could kind of use them for a little bit of whatever. So yeah, there's quite a few in here, wow, cool. But yeah, you could use these for like some name tags or just labeling things in the classroom or just gift tags. Really neat, right? The next thing is something I'm super excited about and I'm probably gonna be using in my normal planning sessions is this A Plus style sticker pad. It's got 16 pages of stickers and there's more than a thousand in here. I'm so excited for this. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm an excitement overload at the moment. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh, and this like feels like really nice. Oh, it's got like a little window. So these are some gorgeous stickers. These are those like clear stickers, which are in their new sticker book. There's kind of like the regular matte stickers and then some of the like clear transparent stickers. These are those and they just, they feel so nice. Um, and there's a bunch of sayings on there, a bunch of decorative elements. And then we get into some regular stickers. So some nice functional stickers with some tabs and then little flags, more flags and these have some nice little apples on them and then these ones have stars on them oh and then we've got a lot of like meeting things so like there's a just a blank spot to blank spot so you could you know put in a time or something like that It'd be really nice in the planner <gasps> these are pretty Ooh, i like these mm, yep I'm gonna need these. Um, these are gold and then they have a little asterisk right there. Ah, love a good aligned anything. This is so nice. Oh, these are really cute. Um, these are little binder clips and some have just like little paper clips, so nice. And then we've got some quotes. And then these, here I'll look at it this way. Um, these are really, really nice. Some nice school sayings and teacher sayings. Back to the this way. And then this page, again, is one of those transparent pages. It's really glossy. Oh, it feels so nice, like butter. And then we're back to the regular paper that has a bunch of the days of the week on it. Ooh, this is the glossy paper again with all the different icons on there. And then again, the glossy with um, the alphabet. More alphabet, O oh, and numbers. And this is the regular paper. And then this is all the rose gold and the capital letters. Oh my gosh, I'm really excited about this, you guys. And next up, I got this two-sided dashboard in the Live, Love, Learn. And um, yeah, let's, let's, check her, let's check her out. So clearly you can put this inside of your planner, but you know, you can snap it onto here. What I really wanted to do was look at this with this. Oh, and it's definitely that you could fit right here as well. So they did make them a little bit shorter um, for you know the teacher lesson planner ones. So you could put them with your regular um, Erin Condren Life Planner if you wanted to. Very cool, nice. I also got these. These are the Fine Tip Wet Erase Marker Set. They've had the other ones in the past, but this is the Fine Tip one. So I wanted to um, check these guys out and see. So let's let's do it together. So we've got black, and then we've got blue, and we got green, and then this one's kind of a, I don't know, kind of a, a pinky color. Cool. And these do usually take a minute or two to dry, but um, they usually work pretty well is what I've heard. I don't, I don't really use a lot of the wet erase markers in my daily planning, but um, I like that there's a fine tip point though too, because you know the other ones are just a fatter tip point, so you just can't get enough you know, written down sometimes depending on how much text you wanna write down on any, any of the dashboards. Also, you could use these inside of your um, cover right here as well, but yeah, it's totally dry now, so and it's just been a second. No crazy uh, editing going on right there, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> and then the last thing I got, I actually need a scissors for because it was something that was customizable. Um, I actually didn't customize it at all, but I know a lot of people 
would customize it for themselves if they were a teacher, but I just thought it was really interesting and I wanted to see it in person. So this bad boy right here is a substitute report and it's just in the regular rainbow version. So it says substitute report and there's like little dashes for the day and it says class of and that's where you can actually customize it to put your name or what class it is, say if it's like history or I, I don't know, whatever it is. And then this box says helpful people to talk to, so reliable students, other teachers, the principal, vice principal, and then the secretary. And then the time and activity, absences and tardies, classroom behavior, and then some area for notes, what we did today, what we didn't get to today, star students, and then difficult students. Um, so this is really nice. Also on the back are these little um, sticky guys. So you could definitely put this either in like the back of a notebook or you could put this also um, either in the back or the front of this guy right here. I know a lot of people um, end up doing that also. Let me put that right there so it's a little bit more centered in the frame for you. Sorry, I'm like filming and it's not that far away from the camera. <laughs> But this would be really nice too because then it would just sit like this. Whoops, I can't do it right. And then um, it would be up a little bit um, on your actual planner right here, but it would just be nice to have everything all in the same spot. Um, or I know a lot of people that have gotten those planner folios really, really enjoy them. And that would actually be really, really nice to put, you know, something like this in there that you may not use that often. All right, so those are all the things I have to show you today that are my teacher themed haul and first impressions. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. I really, really appreciate it. If you have any questions, feel free to put them down below and I will answer as many of you as I possibly can. Also, all of the Erin Condren links will be down below for you guys. If it's your first time ordering through Erin Condren, there is a $10 off special link for you to follow. Once you sign up, you will get a couple of emails from Erin Condren, but one of them will actually be a unique code for you to get $10 off of your first purchase. And full disclosure, if and when you decide to use that in your order ships, I actually get a $10 gift card to use on my next purchase, which is how I can bring, you know, Erin Condren hauls and giveaways and things like that. And spoiler alert, there will be a giveaway coming up very soon. It will not be on this video, but it will be coming up in the future in the next couple of weeks. So stay tuned for that. I know that this is not a typical haul from me just because this is not something I would be geared towards using in my normal daily life, but I think there's like really fun ways to modify it. So if you modify your Erin Condren teacher planner, let me know in the comments below how you do it. I think that's a really fun idea what I talked about where you could almost use it for your business and have task orientated content inside of the planner and things like that like that would actually be kind of a cool thing to do and then also it's nice because you could like look back on that in a month or two and be like oh yeah I did finish that that project or yes I did send that email or I did do that follow-up so I think it's like kind of cool that we can always just modify things to customize our own lives but anyway that is gonna be it for me today thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today thank you to the Erin Condren team for showing me all of these amazing goodies I really appreciate it and I can't wait to bring you guys more more Erin Condren content in the very near future. So I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and I will talk to y'all in the next video. Bye guys. Well folks, it's time to kick it old school. Uh, so you can feel cool. <laughs> Give it to me baby. <laughs> baby. <laughs> yeah.